Today is the day, everybody. Welcome back to your daily dose. We're here at Port Canaveral for our one and only cruise, the Carnival of Liberty. I've never been on this ship before. It's gonna be a fun one. Welcome back to our cruise adventures. There's nothing like cruise day. Welcome, everybody. The Carnival Liberty, here we are pulling on in. Don't know how much the parking's gonna be, but this is my only, my second only Carnival Cruise. Casey's been on way more than me. Let's get parking and let's get on this cruise. By the way, this is Carnival's own terminal. I've been here one time. We're back. Last time I was at this terminal, guys, I had to wear a mask. It's been it's been that long. And this is Casey's what? What how many cruises have you been on for Carnival? This will be my fifth Carnival cruise. We as a family, when I was younger, we started out with this cruise line and then moved over to Royal. Five, five, this is my second. Let's park in, let's get, let's get going. We just parked and it's $72 for three nights here at Carnival's Port. A lot of money. Gotta love it, here we go. It is so good to be back cruising. If you guys could do me a favor, go ahead and thumbs up the video. And if you guys are new here on the channel, hit that subscribe button. Carnival Liberty, during spring break, I'm very intrigued about this ship. Now the Carnival Liberty, there's about 3,700 passengers, a thousand crew members. It primarily caters to families, family reunions, and spring breakers. There's gonna be one indoor pool, three outdoor pools, a spa, a casino, there's 12 restaurants. We're gonna be dining at a specialty restaurant. There's four bars, 36 activities, three shows, and eight other venues. It was built in 2005 and then renovated in 2016, but its most recent dry dock was in 2021 to overhaul the whole of the, the hall, the hall of the ship to basically look like the Carnival Mardi Gras. You ready? I'm so excited. For our second cruise? And it's our first cruise just the two of us. I know. It's gonna be great. I know. I'm so excited to be back. No uh no surprises this cruise, right? No, it's not my birthday cruise. So. Or no engagement no or anything? Surprises. No, no surprises. There she is. The Carnival Liberty. It's a smaller boat. Um second carnival, like I said, you can already hear the music. <laughs> it's gonna be a party. It's gonna be interesting. <laughs> Boarding a spring break cruise. We'll, we'll see what the vibes are. Um, boarding, I believe, began at 10. We are uh, 12.30. And I believe the last uh, all aboard is 2.30 with us leaving here at 3.30. Next up, uh, NASA Bahamas. Wowzers. We've got quite the line to get into. I did not expect that at all. Did we buy anything to skip that? I don't think we did. No, no, we and did. we're not high enough status. <laughs> Definitely not. Um, keep in mind, guys, my favorite ever cruise, one of my favorites was the Carnival Mardi Gras. Obviously, it's a, it's a newer ship, way bigger, but I have high hopes for this Carnival ship. We'll see. We shall see. Comment down below if you guys have ever been on Carnival or if you guys have an upcoming cruise. Want to try getting on board, see how long this yes. takes? I wonder if these are people that are early to their boarding time. Might be, we should hurry up. <laughs> I hope so, because we're like at the end of our boarding time. Let's, let's go, go, let's go, let's go, let's go. I didn't really expect there to be a line outside, rather the line inside. Who knows, well, I know this terminal is really beautiful. It's cruise day! It's cruise day! It's cruise day. All right, let's see how we get to join this line. This is all new to me. Oh yeah, they do have arrival times. Okay. I guess that was right. So it looks like we might be able to skip that line because that is like a line for a later arrival appointment. We're 12.30. Sorry, we're 12 to 12.30. Do you have our papers? I do. All right, Carnival has you print them out. Good thing you have a printer, because I don't. And funny me for printing a checked bag thing for Kyle. Pretty oh yeah, needed. guys, wait till we get on board. I, I, we gotta talk about what, what we all brought. I only have a backpack, but wait till you see what Casey brought. Here we go, without further ado, let's go on in to Terminal Launch Pad 3. I thought I was gonna say Carnival. Looks like we didn't get a special line for 12 to 12.30. Nice, free water here. That's 
I wonder how long this is gonna take. Let's clock it, okay? sure why they had the different arrival times in different lines because they just let all of us they said if you have a boarding pass printed you can all just go forward I wonder if it's because we are grouped with everybody else now I don't know I don't know I don't know all I know is we're late by five minutes oh my gosh guys we can see the line indoors this might take a while I think this is the longest I've seen a security point to get on a cruise in a long time if that's what we're about to join that was so long Remember when last, or two weeks ago, and we just walked right on? Uh, yeah. Okay, here's where we're now going to our arrival appointment section. So we did get that right. Yeah. We had a little bit of a shorter line. They made us put our bags on the ground. It looks like it's because there is a dog coming around to sniff here in security. And just like that, we are through. Surprisingly, that only took about 12 minutes. We thought it was a longer line. Yeah, that took like 12 minutes. It's 45, 50, okay, 20. 20, we'll round up. <laughs> that was really efficient, surprised. And um, I think next step is to go check in and board. Or we yeah. technically just checked in. Well, we did, but they said the only thing we need now is our actual boarding pass. And then we, I think we just scan this. And then we go on. And then we go on. Let's go. Should we take one of these fun photos? All right, let's do it. <laughs> Last time I remember, I did not take one of these photos because we were on the Mardi Gras and it was just too hyped to get on. Is there, there's only one person doing it. Oh, can we, can we do it? Yeah, let's do it. This is the first time I've ever, I'm ever doing this. The first time. Not my first time. <laughs> this yeah. Okay. Right. <laughs> All they check for is that little stamp. Otherwise they send you over to guest services. That was a very seamless process. Wasn't bad at all. Good job, Carnival. Good job. Guys, it's Carnival's 50th birthday. Now, I don't know when, but this isn't my birthday cruise. This is Carnival's, Carnival's birthday, birthday cruise. cruise. We gotta look that up. Let's Google. You know, technically this is an Easter Easter cruise as well, just as a, a spring break cruise. But we did just find the birthday was last year. It's technically it's in its 50th year, though. They already celebrated. We're celebrating this whole year. So it is still Carnival's birthday cruise. Technically. In my eyes. Big step. Vacation begins. Can I get a woo woo woo? Woo 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 Casey. That wasn't me and she was I know, you gotta do it. Woo 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 Let the fun times begin, baby. Here we go, I gotta fix my collar. Feels a little, little, little wacky here. The Carnival Liberty. Three, two, one. And we're on. Yay! Woo -hoo -hoo. You always remember where you walk in. <laughs> Welcome to the Carnival Liberty. Wow, look at the detail up here. So, how much we have our oh, okay. up on our phone? I just want to ask a quick, quick question, just a simple question. Okay. Before we do anything, it looks like they're making us do our uh, mustard drill. We gotta get our mustard. mustard. We gotta get our mustard. They tell us where to go. Um, I actually like that better. First? Doing it first and then going and exploring and eating. And our room will be ready by 1.30, so only about 30 minutes. I like that. I also like the first impressions. It's beautiful. It is beautiful. It's very nice. We gotta get some drinks pouring here soon. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm not putting you in a spot. Beautiful. I'm just, I'm just. Okay. First impressions, not too bad. Oh, look at metal detector. This is where we'll find our photo later. Oh, it is. After we had someone greet us downstairs, they just told us to go up one deck. And we're kind of lost right now at the moment getting to our muster station. Oh, yeah, there's metal detectors everywhere here. That's interesting. I've never seen that on a cruise ship. A what? Welcome to, to 2005. I think I found it. I think we're going this way. I think you're right. Whoa, look at the vibe of the Casey. Look at the elevators. Wow. I can tell the age of this ship but just by walking to our muster station right here. But, you know, we, we know what our expectations are for this ship. We're here to have a fun time. 
and be on a new cruise ship. The way I see it, I'd rather be on a cruise, even if it's old, than not on a cruise. Comment down below if you guys right. agree with that. I agree with that. As long as we feel safe, which I trust Carnival, I think we'll be okay. We'll be okay. It's like a one-on-one -on -one muster station. We are so interested in this ship. We can totally tell the size of the ship just by being, it looks mm -hmm. like in one of the main dining halls right now. It's it's obviously a tiny ship, but we just went to our muster station. <laughs> and he, what does he ask? He was like, do you need a demonstration of the life jacket? And we're like, we looked at each other like, no, no we're we've good. been on many cruises. He's like, okay, you're good. <laughs> we just had to scan in. That was interesting. Okay. Interesting. <laughs> Oh, this is a bad sign. I already found the casino. Oh boy. It's a big one. Oh, yo, they have Wheel of Fortune. I just saw it. I just saw it. I just saw it. Just saw it. Like, look, Wheel of Fortune. It does smell smoky in here. You definitely can smoke on in this casino, but look at that Wheel of Fortune. Coming in a future vlog. I think this, this is going to be the one right here. It better be. Going up to a room, we we see all the luggage getting delivered. We're seeing if the if it's ready. We're on deck six. We're Gotta, deck eight. Oh yeah, but we have to go to deck eight. Yeah, we're currently on deck six, but we're we're gonna stay on deck eight. I almost said living. Are we gonna do a no stairs challenge? I mean, sorry, no elevator challenge. Yeah, I thought we were doing that anyway. Good. I hope. And unfortunately, my sister's not here, and I can't just like pretend to use the stairs to actually the elevator. Oh, so we're, like at the top, basically. we're already at the top. No, but we're like staying. Rooms aren't ready, but we made it to the top because of the blue iguana. Do you want to get something to eat right now or no? I would rather wait to put my bag down and then eat. Okay. We're not worried about that, but I don't know. Definitely, I am hungry. Definitely a tinier vibe right now. We already knew that though. Look, like they have a slide. I don't know if this is weird to say, but we both just looked at each other and we're like, we feel like we're on a cruise. Like, I feel like we didn't, some of the newer ships. We didn't feel like that yeah, like on uh, like Virgin. It. They just felt so different. This feels like a cruise. Yeah. I feel like the Virgin cruise kind of felt like a resort. Where this, I'm like, yeah, I'm on it. This is a cruise. Not a bad thing. I mean, we obviously came for a cruise. Yeah, we did. We gotta get a drink. like on like a Bahamas day. Interesting. We found a place called Serenity. It's 21 and older. This yes. feels more like our vibe. It's at, I think, is this the back or the front? Uh, the back. Never. No. The front. Or the front. The front. Look, it's a hidden Mickey. We find Mickeys everywhere we go. <laughs> Just walking around, I can definitely tell the age of the ship. This is definitely the non-party zone, and that's why I think we're kids. where we're gonna be. Another? Oh, I thought it was another hidden Mickey. No, but there's kid, like a kid's play area. Oh, here. whoa! There's a play area. On that's where we just were. Yeah, that's, that's interesting placement. Yeah, it's gonna be loud. <laughs> An activity zone? Or this is probably a day at sea with tons of loungers. Right now, it's nothing besides the the pool slide. Slide actually looks fun. It does look fun. That's a nice slide. A hard take is this ship kind of feels like an upgraded Margaritaville at sea. That's the best way to put it. Still gonna keep an open mind on this ship, but yeah, obviously it is not up to par with all the other ships that we've been on. And we knew that going in. This is pretty cool. Casey and I were coming here like, what in the world is this? A roller coaster at sea? I thought that was on the Carnival Mardi Gras, but this can get converted into an indoor pool. I don't think I've ever seen anything like this. Wow. That's crazy. I think this is where the buffet is too. I think we're done exploring for now. Our room should it be ready at the moment. Um, first impressions? 
you know, it's not Virgin, it's no. not Disney, it's not Royal, it's, it's, a, it's an upgrade from the Margaritaville at sea. We're going to have to see uh, where adventures take us throughout this, and I don't know, keep an open mind, guys, yes. but we we're knew fun. we were getting on quite a bad ship. <laughs> I wouldn't say it's bad, it's just not, compared to like the last cruises we've been on, it's still going to be a good time. <laughs> Eight, three, six, seven. seven. Gotta find our room. Eight, three, six, seven. <laughs> What's up? Do you know where to go? Impressed. I'm impressed. Thank you. I think we're almost there already. Eight, three, six, seven. We're by the stairs. Oh, nice. How convenient. Boom shakalaka. Mm -hmm. Let's okay, see so what's it inside. Says, if this envelope has been opened or tampered with in any way, please visit. Blah, blah, blah. Blah, 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 where we get upgraded <laughs> to the, the suite. That was easy. In we go. What is this? Whoa, very orange. <laughs> wow. Well, we've got a big change, obviously, from our last cruise. This is why I and Casey starting to go on more cruise ships so you guys can see more what's out here. This is kind of what I expected to look like. Here's our cabin. Well, here's where you enter. It is very orange. Not my favorite type of colors in a room. I feel like the best thing about this is if Casey goes and opens those doors. Let me do that. What are you going to show us? The closets actually have a lot of space. They're sectioned off in three different parts. We have the hangers. More hangers. More hangers. <laughs> and then these are kind of like drawers and well, a full I'll take that a full-size mirror you know I love that <laughs> I'll take that we haven't even checked the bathroom in. I don't know if I'm excited or scared to check it out it's not gonna be that bad Ooh. oh oh it's kind of ugly terrible lighting yo ew it's like blue and green and yellow mixed together it kind of looks like a hospital not my favorite but it definitely is an upgrade from the <laughs> Margaritaville at sea. You do have a lot of space. It's kind of yes. big though, I will say that. The colors though, the aesthetic is definitely a miss in these cabins. I can't help it. I know we should not compare ourselves to others, but I cannot stop comparing this in my mind to Virgin Voyages. Guys, yeah, that we- That room um, was so nice. We booked late, so we oh. kind of didn't really get a good deal on this ship. We actually paid more for this than Virgin Voyages, so. Yeah, this one kind of does kind of hurt a little bit. I mean, it's it's big. It's just, you know, it's hard to compare from what we what we had, you know, before. So comment down below, what are your guys' thoughts? Not my favorite by far, considering I really love Carnival Mardi Gras. You know, that was a new ship. This one is pretty dated. I, um, we're gonna keep an open mind. We're gonna have to see if we really think you guys should book this. Yeah. But, you know, we're keeping an open mind. We'll see there's tons of food. Besides all the aesthetics, maybe it will, it will be a good ship. The food looks and smells good. I think we're, we're good there. I think we are, hopefully. But I don't know, comment down below, what do you guys think of the cabin? Not my favorite. It does feel big though. It does yeah. feel, feel pretty big. There's good space. There is pretty good space. Good space, and is this, it looks like there's more storage under here, or is this where the- Pillows, no, no, nothing. Maybe pillows. I'm sure it opens, I'm just not giving it my all right now. <laughs> yeah, okay. Let's go uh, on our balcony, because we did get a balcony. Our balcony has a window, so it's a door, it's not a sliding glass, so we have like a, a boat coming through, look at this. Wow. That's cool. Didn't expect to see that. Here's our, our balcony. You know, there's space. It's pretty closed off from our neighbors. There looks like nothing's extended. But as far as the room goes, you This is a heavy door. <laughs> it actually kind of is. I'm going to give this room a... The, the natural light actually kind of helps it. Now that I think about it, the orange is just a vibe kill for me. I'm going to get a 5 out of 10. So with all that, I want you guys to keep an open mind. I'm personally trying to keep an open mind on this ship here as well, just cause it's, you know, it's, it's dated, but we'll see how it goes, how the food is, how the service, 
Um, but we're really kind of going for the destination. We're, we want to go to the Bahamas. Casey has never been to Atlantis, so we're going to be going to Atlantis. Um, that's going to be it for this video, guys. We'll have part two coming up tomorrow, hopefully. Um, but with that, um, I want you guys' opinions and first impressions down below. You guys know what mine are. I want to know what yours are. And uh, we'll see you guys tomorrow. Sneak peek for tomorrow's episode. Got the duck shirt on, and we're going to hide some ducks. <laughs> Around the ship. Let's go. Let's go. We're keeping an open mind. What was that voice? I don't know. I'm just really excited. Even though this might not be my favorite so far, we're still cruising, baby. Yeah, we are. We're still cruising. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye-bye.